we go. What's going on my fellow Z Fighters? My name is Eveler Spartan and welcome back to my channel. Now today I'm going to be talking about Majin characters and how they could have improved it in this game. Or how I think, how I personally feel they could have improved it. Now the first game, you yeah, had your Majin characters. They were okay. I mean, Majin characters, right? Pretty normal to see them fat, I guess. But in the second game, I, I seen that you can't make a skinny Majin character. So I was very disappointed at that. Um, I wish you could choose between skinny and fat, not just fat and less fat. So that right there was like a thumbs down for me for that character. I wasn't too excited to try out that character. I didn't even make one. So I feel like they should have given you the opportunity to be able to change the sizes more. Like you could make a fat Majin Buu all the way to the skinny evil Buu. Or in between a muscular Buu like Super Buu. <clears throat> And not just that, since they didn't give us the choice to be to pick between a skinny Majin Buu or a fat one for the male characters. Um, another thing is their Awoken skill or their transformation. So they go into pure Buu or pure Majin mode or Majin Buu mode, the little the kid kid Buu mode, whatever you know what I mean. They turn into that mode, and that's it. And I think I've heard a lot of people complain about that because. Their stamina runs low. I'm not too sure. I think I've read random things. If I'm wrong, correct me. I'm sorry if I am wrong. But I think their stamina drains too fast. So it's not a it's not an awoken skill you could leave on the entire game versus like Super Saiyan or Golden Frieza mode or potential unleash. So I thought that was annoying as well. And since they only give us one transformation, which was kinda like annoying too for that specific race. I feel like they should have at least thrown in like a super boo mode or a evil boo mode where you could transform from fat boo to a black evil boo or a super boo since they didn't give us the option to be able to pick from being a skinny Majin Buu character or a fat Majin Buu character. I just feel like that race could have more potential and creation and they didn't give us that. They should have done it this time around I guess because I mean the first game was fun and I'm pretty sure a lot of people asked for a skinny version of Majin Buu or Majin characters but we didn't get that um, I don't know if they were paying attention to the fan base saying what kind of characters we want or like more customization but if they're if they make a Xenoverse 3 I feel like they should actually put more transformations in for that race or at least give us a more of an option and being able to pick on how fat or skinny or muscular the Majin character is. And <clears throat> just like a little fun idea, I'm pretty sure it'd be really cool if they threw into where you could get ultimate Majin Buu or when you like absorb Gotenks, Gohan or Piccolo and then you become a little bit more stronger at each transformation gives you a different power or like a different boost overall the characters the race actually i mean uh, i didn't like too much this time around last time around i was like okay i'll make one it's just a majin Buu character i want to try out every character or every race so this time around i was like no i'm not gonna make a majin character just because they didn't give us the options to um pick the size and then the transformations are very limited you only get two things pretty much just the pure boo form and then or the pure majin form and potential unleashed so i thought that was very annoying discouraged me a lot from making an actual majin character i still haven't made one i plan on making one just to see how pure pure uh majin form is and see how it works out and stuff like that i haven't tried it out so I need to check it out, see see what's up with that. Oh, and one more thing, I totally forgot to mention this or to add this. I think they should have. I think it would have been a really cool idea to actually add a oob transformation to where you could become your regular Majin Buu character transforms into an oob character or an oob version of your character. I think the game could have had 
so much potential and being able to customize your characters like being able to choose how your outcome transformation looks slightly now i know it's completely different i mean it's really weird because oob is a human but he is the reincarnation of boo we all know that so i think it would have been kind of cool being able to get a majin character and then when he transforms picking how he looks when he transforms slightly like a pure form I mean has to be small has to be pure evil looking but how they gave us the option to change colors that's pretty cool so if they would have been able to give us the option to where we could make a Majin character transform into an oob like character or like a human I think that would have been pretty cool I mean some people might disagree with me and if you disagree with me that's completely fine everybody's entitled to their own opinion but I think it would have been pretty cool getting a oob transformation of Majin characters to where you could pick your character make them look short or tall and it's just a reincarnation of the Majin character that you have and make them you know be able to customize the hair and the height the skin color and the fitness of the character I think that would have been pretty cool if you guys agree or disagree let me know in the comment section below if you guys like this type of video let me know and I'll continue to make more on my thoughts and what I feel about certain characters or certain things that the universe or Dragon Ball Super could have done differently or maybe like cool little ideas but thanks for watching guys hope you guys enjoyed the video my name is Evil Spartan stay tuned and I'll see you guys next time